My dear friends in Jesus Christ, all of us try to nurture good intentions intensively confined to our minds and hearts. And often the result is that the good will remain internally unable to produce for the well-being of the other. Judas, one among the twelve, has agreed for the betrayal and he is looking for a favorable time. However, the evil has conquered his entire self, surpassing the goodwill. But Jesus submitted his entire self to the Heavenly Father. The attitudes of both Jesus and Judas direct us to think about our life altogether. Are we always equipped with intentions for the destruction of the other, surpassing the goodness and the goodwill within us? Or do we have a total submission to the will of the Father who has created and set forth a plan for our prosperity even in the midst of adversaries? God has given us the freedom and He expects that we will grow in freedom by nurturing the nature of God that is love, mercy and forgiveness. Let us direct all our intentions for the good relying on God's providence.